Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with Ghost on the Shore, which is a new game. It's on Steam and we're going to play it. Um, we're going to see what the game is about. So far it's got a very nice blue aesthetic. Oh, and pretty uh, glowing trees. I'm already on board. Ooh, and a nice little soundtrack. Cool. So we're in for a nice chill time, I'm hoping. Oh, the music got real intense real fast, didn't it? A game by Like Charlie. The opening is bold. Published by Application Systems Heidelberg. Okay. That sounds like someone who makes, like, ATM software. So I've got no control at the moment. This is definitely uh, what is this? cinematic. Oh, we've got, to rain today. We got voice acting. Uh oh, we're in trouble. <laughs> Man, oh, here we go. Oh, this is useless. Can't tie up the boat now. Oh, excellent. Okay, so we're not tying up the boat. Oh, no, I'm going to die. Oh, dear, there's a Rubik's Cube on the ground. Is there anything we can do here? Is that land? God, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, there's a big rock. This can't be happening. No, 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 no. Not the rocks. Oops. No. Damn it. This was a mistake. Get me out of here. Somebody. What? Yeah, hello. How to hold left mouse button and drag to anybody there? It's a voice. You can hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I mean, I kind of do want to know, actually. So, where? I mean, if it doesn't already have a bunch of holes in it. do that. That is very weird. Oh, I can move around now. Excellent. Okay. Oops. See what window? This is very weird, man. What a surreal little opening. Um. Yeah. Hold on a sec, team. I'm just realizing that maybe I need to turn the volume up because I can see that my voice is spiking over the top of this so there we go 
All right. We did. Oh. I ruined my boat, and then we cut to black. So beautiful from here. You should go. I decide my own fate. I'm living my life. That was the plan, after all. So yes, be a devil. Let's what? check our backpack. I have no desire to get stranded without food or water. Uh, okay. Never leave without your music. Nice. Soul food. Excellent. Can't starve, right? Corned beef. Take Not. That with me. I am sketching the entire journey after all. All right. All right. We looked at all the objects. Does that say antimatter? I feel like that says antimatter. Why can't I pick up the book, the cool book that says antimatter? What if I need to know about antimatter? Okay. I guess we're going for a walk. Right? Cool. So let's make sure that we've got everything that we need. I read this book front to back. Pretty useless in a store. Ha! Nice. Right. Oh, mug. Great. Out of coffee. You'll be baking for more. Nice. Why are these islands not on here? Ha! <laughs> I don't know. Why aren't they on here? What else have we got? We got some tapes. We got a record player. See, this was good thinking, Riley. Food supplies. Why didn't I think to check the damned weather glass? A very delicious snack that's easy to snack on. The original taste, whatever that says. Right. All right. Cool. Some sort of TV dinner there. Got a dog basket. Right. So, what else have we got? We got some tissues. We've taped that up. So, we fixed all that. Excellent. Oh. That's my doggle. You know, I think this is the silliest thing you've ever done. Still, I hope you guys make it out alive and that you don't sink the boat freak i don't know take care of something sink the iron freak take care of this dude i'll miss him all oh, right okay is that all of it <clears throat> it is all of it okay all right i think we've explored the boat now it's time to go explore the not boat oh first let's go around the side See if there's anything around the boat that we have missed. Dun dun, just walk. Oh, there was something. What's that? How do we how do we get to that? Because that's something we missed. There's a cooler. I forgot to open the cooler, team. We're gonna open the cooler. Awesome. The beer made it through the storm. Ha. Later. Nice. Now I can get wrecked. I'm on an island, about to get lit. Um, here we go. All right. Oh, our, our walking speed is faster now. Okay. I'm doing it. Deciding my own fate. And will you look at all this? So beautiful out here. Wish you were here. Sunny greetings from a far off place. The Rogue Islands. You're still here. Um, yeah. Thank you for last night. <clears throat> grateful and all. But... You know you can't stay, right? Why? Because you're not real. But I am, Riley. I've decided you are not. <laughs> never say my name. Ever again. You know what? Just shut up. I mean, that is... As good as endless oceans, the edge of the world. That is pretty rude. That building. Interesting. The only one to survive. Yeah. 
So we can't. So this is all just uh, set decoration. That's fine. The game has a plan, and I will follow that plan willingly. Oh, what's over here? Right. So there's a limit to what we can explore, and that's okay. I don't mind. I like this guy talking to me. Did they all honestly leave? Let's say. The bear's head. Oh, yeah. Looks like there's a ladder there. Alright. So we're going up this way. Oh. So I can't... So I can't go explore that one building? I can't go there. Huh? Okay. Uh, I'll fast forward a sec, because I'm going to go try and go th to that building, because I feel like... I should have been able to, so, yeah. May. Wonderful. There's so much I want to ask you. So much I don't know yet. Or I've forgotten. I like this guy. I said maybe. Don't get carried away. It's been way too long since I got to talk to anyone. I understand that, but I will lose my mind if you don't. Please, just talk to me. That's it. I'm blocking you. You're spam. Ha! <laughs> spam? What's spam? Rose Hill. Yeah, so it turns out I wasn't supposed to go that way, and that's fine. So this dude's, like, talking to me. He doesn't know what spam is. Um, the meat or the... Email thing. You. you can talk now. You're not imagining me. This is very pretty. Very pretty indeed. I like these flowers. This is cool, man. It's the sort of game that you want to take photos of because it's obviously like really lovingly crafted. So I'm to nice. totally here for it. Alright, so this dude doesn't know what happened. I don't know what happened. This dude's like an amnesiac. And I drove a boat through a storm to get here, which seems foolhardy at best. Right. You never taught me your name. Josh. My name's Josh. So he knows his name. His name's Josh! Hello, Josh. My name is... I don't remember. Riley. Yeah, I do remember now. Oh, what a pretty little cottage. Right out of a country magazine. Uh, what do you know about it? I don't remember. I'm sorry. Let's see. Oh, uh, yeah. It's not really out of a magazine. Oh. Seriously? <laughs> Piccalilli is as far as I go. You'd eat it if you were here in the winter time. Right. Oh God. Why can't I? I'm trying to. I'm trying to rotate it so that I can read it, but it doesn't. It doesn't like rotating properly. There we go. Put lid on tight and store in a cool spot. Note: make sure there's room in the jar for the eggs to move around. So this is pickled eggs. Right. Cool. It's cool. I like that it's handwritten stuff. Roses. Excellent. We are exploring. We are exploring. Oh. 1980. Berries after 1980. Um, right. So something happened in 1980 to, uh, to cause problems. Why did this Margot never open a letter? Hmm. Let's read it. Let's read it here, because I bought the stationery when I moved to the islands, having every intention to write to friends left far behind. But this is the first plate piece I've ever used. My life was here. No letter would change that, and pictures were my talent, not words. 
must be told in words, and as you won't allow me to speak the words, I'll buck it down and write them. I must go, even though I don't want to. How I hate to leave you, Margo, but time is not our friend, and time is becoming unkind to me. So these are the rogue islands, I think? Right. So, Carrie. Alright. So we've read that. We're getting more more information all the time. Is there anything over here? Oh, there's a photo. Hello. Do you think it's them that lived here? Maybe. I'm here always. Aw. That's very cute. So this guy's now talking to us about everything. That's cool. Oh. She's beautiful. She looks so sad. Beloved. Oh yeah. And there's like a little kid. Oh, why do those little kids' eyes that looks real evil, but that's okay. The boy. Yeah, maybe there's a reason their eyes look like that. That's weird. Are they like dead or something? Is that the twist? Oh. Definitely the home of a photographer. Cool. Right. Oh, we found a garden. It's very pretty. Oh. Is that a cassette tape? No way. A what? Oh, I want to hear this. So we're going to sit down and listen. Nice. Testing. One, two. Well, hello to myself, I guess. Or dear diary. Or however you're supposed to begin these things. Just if I don't talk to someone, I'll go insane. Even if it's only myself. I guess I'll start at the beginning. The rogue seemed like a good idea. A bunch of us were looking for a place to hang out, make music, and just, you know, be greedy together. And it was cool. So totally chill. But then the nightmare began. And I don't know if it was the drugs or me going crazy, but when the others left, it got worse. I'm glad she was here, Carrie. Or I would have lost it completely. I miss her. I was so rotten to her. I just didn't want her to leave, you know. I understood she had to. I mean, she was sick. And I couldn't take care of her. She knew that. So she left me food. Recipes. Not that I'll ever cook. She remained behind. Was she here all by herself? Must have been. That's depressing. Ooh, we can go out onto the edge. Ooh. What do you think about the cabin? I don't know. I need to have an opinion. Did you read the letter? I did. Why did Carrie write Margot a letter? She felt guilty about leaving her. How do you know that? Because that's what she told Margot. What are you saying? I heard her say it. I was there. This is great. You knew her. I can't believe I forgot. But now you remember. Like she'd always been there. Somewhere in the back. And now she's taken a step forward. Into the light. That's cool. You knew Carrie. I get the feeling you think this is important. Did you see that date? 1980. You were alive in 1980. Oops, did I trigger something? I think I triggered something. Whoops. That's really annoying. I was enjoying that conversation. Ugh. But I've now triggered the next phase. Oh well. I was just exploring. I didn't mean to trigger the next thing. Sorry. Sorry game. Sorry guys. If I miss something, I miss something. I'm very... I apologize. 
I didn't mean to. But that's okay. We missed out on some stories. That's very pretty. It's very loud as well. I like that. That's a good that's good attention to detail. Good sound design. I like it. I like it. Thank you, I guess. Though you're not giving me a lot of options. You talk a lot. Yeah. Maybe you should talk more, so that I have to listen. <laughs> I don't want to talk. You're not going to make this very easy, are you? What do you want from me? I'm not pouring out my heart to you. I'm not asking you to. Just tell me about the good stuff. The good stuff was me on my boat sailing off to New Horizons. I didn't call in that storm if that's where you're going with this. I know that. I just want to draw some chalk lines up there and for you to stay on your side quietly. I could try. Rude. I want to talk to him. But I do like th that our character has character, you know? Because sometimes they don't. This island's very cool. Oh, make a sketch. So. Oh, that is very cool. So I didn't get to keep the letter? Oh, right. Cool. be as industrious as the occupant of this cabin was to have planned for the long haul. I'm not sure my jerky will take me far. Oh, right. Who's the boy? So she's she's writing stuff in her journal all the time. Back to square one. Just me and Margo. Oh, stop the slaughter. Friend or food. Don't believe the human lie. Animals don't want to die. Walk me to the sea. I want to see more. Setting my sails to billow in the warm breeze. Take me home over the horizon. Aww. Oh, right, so her family makes that bacon stuff. Something so odd about seeing the remains of a dark room as if looking at a negative. What remains when the image is taken away? She looks so lost. Did she want to be saved? Very cool. I, I think I like it here. The robes are magnificent. I've seen nothing like it. Is that a weird thing to say? Not in my book. You've seen many islands. Not really. I was going to, you know, before the storm. Before you. Yeah. Sorry about that. That's okay, I guess. Aww. They're making friends. Sort of. I think she still wants them to just, like, be quiet. Oh, there's more... There's more buildings and stuff. Cool. Some flowers. I like all the flowers. Yeah, the game is very pretty. Big bold colors. It's kind of like yes. Oh. Oh, no, sorry. I was just saying your name out loud. Why? To see if I sound like a crazy person. Then again, define crazy, right? By my definition, you're not crazy. How can you be sure? Questioning your sanity would be to dismiss my whole existence. That's deep. Right. Ooh, pretty. Oh, there's a little pond. That's cool. I bet there's fish in that pond and some frogs. I'd be so stoked if I saw a frog. Oh, there's lots of burbs. Cool. I like this game, man, because it's it's really uh, giving you that sort of thrill of exploring a place, you know? Lots of games struggle with that. Um, the last one I played that was really good at it was like Gone Home. You know, it was exploring that house, you know, it had that nostalgia. It was lovely. Um, 
Ooh, another letter. Terrence. Must be the guy that lived here. Well, let's read it. I like that. Aside from the usual 30 milk cookies for the school, I would love to order surprise birthday cake or pie. Sweet Lucy turns 11 this Wednesday. Lucy has suffered these last few weeks. Her father and brothers having left off to the mainland. Right? People who understand the land's beauty and magic, the smell of your bread brings everyone hope and comfort. Aww. If you cannot make that work, let us opt for a sweet lamb pie. I know those pies are delicious. Aww, that's lovely. So she wrote about it. Let's read what she wrote. Oh, right. So that's all she wrote? That's all she wrote. Ooh, there's a cookbook. A cook? Of some sort. Sheep work well. Plenty from Sally's Den. Tried wild hay. Inks work fine. Four feet of lounge trifle. Right. All right, so this is a wonderful jelly for trifle. Love to make it for Christmas. Cool. That's very cool. Oh. I don't think he used this to make pizza. That's for baking bread. What's pizza? Don't worry about it. Huh. <laughs> why does he not what Why does he not know what pizza is? That's weird. I don't get it. Why keep all of these? They're just common shells. Hmm. Why indeed? Boats. All boats. Yeah, I mean, but you're sketching everything as well, so you can't talk trash there. Young lady. Right. So we went through we went for a little explore through the cottage. Oh, and now that there's an outhouse out here, let's go look at that as well. It's all, it's all full. Okay. Okay, okay. Alright, so... Where's the continue button? Well, where's the continue... I mean, where are we supposed to go from here? Alright. I think... Have we explored the whole house? I think we have. So he or she was a cook? He was. Terrence. Terrence. No, but I make brilliant scrambled eggs. <laughs> That's what I was told when I was 12. By who? My mum. With that book of his, I could learn to cook. That guy was so passionate about cooking. I assume it was a guy that wrote that? Yeah, Terence. Right. Can I ask about anything else? I can't ask about anything else. Okay. Is this, this isn't the way we came from. Oh, there's a church and stuff? Oh, look at that. This is so pretty. This is so cool. Oh. I didn't come here. I just left where I used to be. And where did you used to be? In a dead-end job. With a father that didn't want me around. I decided I deserved something else. So you got on the boat. You sailed away. You got that right. The stillness of the night skies. Letting the stars speak to me. I guess that sounds silly to your ears. Not at all. I've done nothing but talk to the stars out here. There's weird sound coming from this place. What is this? Cordelia. Mm, I don't like that name. Um, sure. Oh, did we do some sketching? Nice. She must have been a real pleased with herself. I can tell the cooking was the love of his life. Aw, lovely. What's this? Is this a letter? In a tin can. What does it say? Uh. 15th of February, 
My dear little elfins, the more I learn about the Crown family, the more I realize what wolves they were. As I've mentioned, the Crowns owned this island back in its heyday, where they were a haughty bunch and they took much more than they gave. But as I write these words cursing the Crown family, I realize that perhaps I am no better. True, I never owned an island, but like the Crowns, I didn't value life. Once he has seen such horrors, how can he pretend they don't exist? I miss you all dearly, and hope to find my way home to you soon. Your father. Something's not right. I can't figure him out. He knew about the crimes. Wolves. They're not so bad. They are if you're a sheep. Yeah, so... I love it. It's great. Um, the voice acting is really, really solid. Uh, the The level design is amazing. It's intuitive. I'm having a really good time. I'm definitely going to play the rest of this, but I don't want to spoil it for you guys. So I am going to stop playing now and we'll go look at the description and see what the game has to say for itself. Um, and yeah, that's where we're going to go. All right. Ghost on the Shore, an exploration game about emotional ties that transcend even death. Riley is faced with a headstrong ghost, urging her on an adventure across atmospheric shores and covering the island's tragic secret. Choices and dialogue shape the bond between the two, ultimately deciding Riley's fate. Love it. Developed by Like Charlie and published by Application Systems Heidelberg. Currently costs $24.79, so that's substantial, that's a big ask, but like I said, it's well polished, it's got great, great voice acting, um, the, the user interfa interface is great, um, the level design is fantastic. Um, you know, I'm really enjoying everything that's going on at the moment. So, yeah, like, it's worth it. I would say it's worth it. I mean, I paid for my copy, so I am going to keep my copy. I'm not going to refund it. So then if I'm happy with it, then I'm sure uh, you would be happy with it as well. It is a walking simulator, so if you're not down with walking simulator stuff, um, then this probably isn't for you. But if you are, then this is for you. It's pretty cool. Um, I really want to hone in on how nice the dynamic is between Riley and Josh. Sure that we've only, they've only just met and Josh is inhabiting her body, but they still have time for banter. Um, yeah, it's well put together managed to elicit an emotional response from me. Even thinking back to that moment with the child laughing sends chills down my spine. I didn't quite get there, but that's fine. Um, it is, it is beautiful. It's stunning. It has great artwork. It has a very very good design immersive dialogue every dialogue option is shown only once which makes your choices definite yeah branching narrative yep um discover the branching narrative in multiple endings make emotional choices and experience the consequences immerse yourself into a rich story and atmospheric setting gather clues and investigate what happened full voiceover in english uh linux version coming soon so thumbs up there full review with link coming soon and the game is something else. The art style, music, and narrative really just grab you and pull you into this immersive world. I found myself just staring at the beautiful sights. Yeah, I took a few screenshots. So, like, um, I know that I like a game when I start doing screenies. So, let's see. Like, oh, this is Application Systems Heidelberg. So, okay. So, I've got a few of their games. Oh, yeah. The Longing. I remember that one. And Luna the Shadow Dust. That was also very pretty. So, obviously, they, they make a habit of publishing very pretty games. Um, Grobot. I actually don't remember that one, but I'm sure I played it. Witchtastic. Oh yeah, that one was okay, I think. Yeah. Um, and Ghost on the Shore. Definitely worth checking out. So, um, if you liked the video, if you liked what you've saw, what you've seen here, pick up the game yourself by clicking on the link in the description. Um, leave me a comment down below. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. I would love for you to do that because then you get access to all of my other videos which you already have access to because it's youtube and you can just search for them but then you would get notified every time i put a new video up which is almost every day so um check back here for more videos and i will see you guys next time class dismissed